According to the Post, she's one of the funniest comics to follow on Twitter. She's the host of the Netflix series Tattoo Redo, and she's got some shows coming up at Zadie's. Here with more on all of this, comedian and podcast host Jessime Peluso. Oh, that's alcohol. Yes. That's booze. It's real. That's not stage no. liquor. This is real yeah. stuff. It's good, yeah. isn't it? We want to be honest really with our viewers. Oh, yeah. yeah. Ladies, yes. it's real. It's happening. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I want to tell you that I did something for you both. I ate before I came here. Oh, Because okay. I don't know about you girls. If I don't eat, I'm like, oh, yes, I am. Oh, I'm just like a bear out in the street. You know what? Like, there's that news about the lioness that got yes. loose. That's me when I'm hungry. Yeah. Yes. I'm like, I'm coming in your yard. I need a hot dog. <laughs> you get so hangry. I, ate. I okay. get hangry. Mm, yes. I, it's, mm. it's not even a hunger. It's like a demonic possession. Well, then you mm. throw a little of that on top of it. A little yeah. day drinking. And you get crazy. Are you yes. a friendly when you drink? Are you friend become friendlier, or do you become? Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. I'm, I'm a Mother Teresa. I'm like, what do you need? Do you need money? Do you need a hug? I'll be there, whatever you want me to I go. Whatever you need. I, I, I learned something. I don't know if I can say this. I learned that, th that there are men in the river. Uh, uh, are the there river. men in the Chicago River? Yeah, recently. So I decided it's a horrible thing that if people are dying in the river, but I, I have a business idea. Okay. Because oh. I'm assuming it's mob related. <laughs> And so it makes me think of like Jimmy Hoffa. And so I, I created something people can buy after the show. It's called Jimmy's Swimmies oh, for oh, men okay. to put on their arms so they survive the river. Oh, like oh. under a shirt? Yeah, so you're welcome. I'm solving the problems oh, here in Chicago. Nice. Yes. Thank so, you. That'd be great. If they're walking home, it's like an inflatable, like on an airplane. You're right. You pull the plug. Mm, yes. If you know that there's like a mob guy coming yeah. to collect. And that way you could at least possibly nice. Jason Bourne survive it. Absolutely. I like 100%. this. 100%. Now, yes. speaking of solving problems, we know you do a lot. Mm -hmm. You're a woman of many. Many talents, but this new show, Tattoo Redo, yeah. that solves some problems. I okay. Yeah. Do you old? Uh, do you have a bad tattoo? Yeah, oh, you got that. <laughs> do you have any bad? I have bad tattoos. Yeah, I let crazy people draw on me. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> I've got a couple bad tattoos. Are you getting? I have some things? regrets in my life. Regrets, as we call them in the <laughs> tattoo industry. Yeah. Uh, tattoo Redo was something we actually filmed during COVID, so it was a challenging show to film, and it was people coming on with tattoos they wanted to have cover up. Yeah. And the person that they came with that they brought with them chose the cover-up and the person didn't see until it was done. I, the level of trust you have to I have. Mean. <laughs> and even then, like my sister's my best friend. I don't even let her pick my, mm. my dinner choices. Yes. Nope, let alone what cover-up I'm going to have. On a tattoo. Yeah, and these were big. Yeah, that's the thing about cover-ups people don't realize. Your tattoo has to be covered up, so it's going to be big. Yeah. And this one girl was like, I don't like flowers. And then she got flowers. That's, that's the one on the on the shoulder, right? Yeah. The big floral? Yeah, 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 oh. yeah. It was pretty, though. It was gorgeous. Yes. You know, but pretty. so is a bouquet. Yes. <laughs> yes. Now, are you comforting some of the people if they don't like the cover-up? I like try to as much as possible. I'm gen generally a joyful person, and I like to be positive, but I have a face that shows honesty sometimes. <laughs> yeah, what did you, the, the one, there's one that a mom got her daughter the belly. Oh, girl. Would you? How did you hold that one? Girl, I was you know, like, hmm. love and blessings to everybody. Love and blessings <laughs> to everybody. It's just, I think my face is a problem. I recently was in Italy, and my cousin was just filming me, and we were at a restaurant, and someone walked by, and I, I didn't know I was being filmed, and this person walked by, and I just happened to look at their shirt, and I went, <laughs> and then my cousin puts that on the internet. I'm like, girl, hey, now I'm going to look rude because I was honest. Yeah. Somewhere along the line, being honest is rude. So on the show, I just decide to be like, no, it's great. How do you hold, say, how do you hold that face like that? I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> but it's, it's a, it was a fun show. And, That's you know, awesome. If you trust somebody, or if you don't, be careful, because you might get up on the show and have your tattoo turned into from a demonic possession to a cross. <laughs> to a, oh. Yeah, a cross a with cross. a donut on it. Yeah. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. A uh, couple shows here in Chicago. Yes, I have a couple shows in Chicago. Two tonight, two tomorrow. Wow. A lot of fun. Uh, my fans are amazing. It's like 20-year-old girls and 85-year-old men, yeah, yeah, which yeah. sometimes are couples. Oh. <laughs> yeah. In L.A., I, when I moved to L.A., I here saw Chicago, all these girls. Yeah. Same thing. Yeah. Like, I saw all these girls out with older guys. I'm like, oh, they're so close with their dads. And I didn't realize no. it was their daddy. That's their that low, low, yeah. tea, yeah. low T low rich dude that it's Amy was talking about. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. <laughs> Anna Nicole Smith was a hero. Right? Yes. <laughs> I want to see Loti King. Travel the world. <laughs>
Now, do you tailor your shows for the city that you're in? Like, are you thinking, I mean, clearly you are with the Chicago bit. River there. Yeah, yeah, the Chicago River. And I think Chicago's amazing. Like, I leave LA to search out humanity. Mm. You, yeah. <laughs> it's just, you girls are real here. Mm -hmm. Like, it's yeah. just the yeah. weather that makes you just tough and real and, and relatable. And the and, belly. Yeah, <laughs> you got to protect, protect and warmth. Oh, yeah. yeah, you got the nice, mm. I can't say the word on, right on news, but you guys know it's a yeah. four-letter word. You can say that. Fupa. Fupa. Can say Fupa. Fupa. You just can't say what it means. Oh, I love yeah. Chicago. Yeah. <laughs> but in LA, the girls all sound like you guys make fun of your accent here. But in LA, they all sound like a creeping door that is forever opening. Brr. They're just like, oh, oh my God. God. Yeah. <laughs> Open the door, Felicity. <laughs> well, listen, you're in Chicago uh, yeah. yesterday. <laughs> Thank you, people. I love it. It's Thanks like for sticking around amazing with us. here. We yeah. appreciate it. Hey, mm. make sure you check out our shows again tonight and tomorrow night. Zany's Comedy Nightclub. You know they're on North Wells. Get your tickets right there. Get and, your Jimmy Swimmies. And check out her podcast. Very funny. Very funny stuff. Thank you. I also like John Samos. Oh, he's going to be on the pod. I heard. Yes. I'm so excited. Very excited. Oh, yes. And the stalker pays off, yes. everybody. After <laughs> it for Brood. G coming in with the cut. No, I love you. I love you. Can they still hear us? Yes. yes. All right.